Hey dolls, welcome back to my channel. If you are unfamiliar with who I am, I am Donna CB. Like literally, I am Donna CB. That's my name. Um, I am going to be doing a, not necessarily a week video, but sort of like an unboxing. Um, let me, let me pull out my, um, baby done sent me something um because i want to tell you guys the wigs that i ordered um i ordered from premium lace wigs this is my third time ordering from them um my eye has been bothering me for like a week Oh crap, I'm not even signed that. Sign me out. <laughs> I need a new phone so bad. Um, my screen. Well, I really don't need a new phone, but I want a new phone. I have been up since seven something, seven something this morning. So, uh -huh. Okay, there we go. Oh, I got some catch points. Okay, let's see. Order. I need to wash my hair. Okay, so I ordered two wigs. Okay, there it is. They usually send it in a box, but they send it in. FedEx back this time. So the first week that I ordered, let me brighten up my screen on my phone because I can't see. The first one I ordered is um, I think I actually ordered the wrong thing. Because both of them, I thought, were supposed to be the same texture. Um, different colors, different lengths. But this one is 100% virgin, 100% Brazilian virgin hair. Hair color is natural color. The density is 150. The cap is a 13 by 6 with stretch lace. Elastic band, yes, because I always get an extra elastic band put in. Um, because my head is shaped odd, very odd. Um, the way it fits here, but then it, when it gets to the back, it's kind of loose, and I always take in my adjustable straps as tight as I can get them. But I know I, um, it's really weird because I'm natural, and normally I braid my hair to the back, but here lately. I've been lazy and um, trying to get my hair to grow. Um, it has kind of broke off um, because when I wash it and I detangle it, I snag it a lot. I don't take my time with it. I just and then I blow dry it. Then I had been trying to get it straight with the um, blow dryer and uh, hot comb. And flat iron and got a lot of heat damage so I'm actually in the process of trying to get it to grow back I actually need to go to Target tomorrow um, they have some oil that I have been trying to get I could have ordered it when I ordered all this other stuff from Amazon but it's like $10 in the store and like 18 bucks on Amazon 
18 bucks on eBay and it's probably about this size which is one ounce 30 milliliters so I'm not paying $17 for something that's this size nine dollars okay I can do but it's um by Miel Miel something um I seen Rashida using it on Instagram and I seen a, a couple other people using it so I was like oh okay you know I want to try that but uh yeah so I got off track um, the lace is transparent. Um, they do not have the HD lace like every other wig company has went to. Um, China Lace Wiz has been constantly sending me emails, but they tried to scam me. Um, they sent me an email maybe two months ago for me to order a, a unit for four ninety nine, and I was like, okay, cool. You know, they um, were promoting their HD lace. I proceeded to order the wig paid they took my money they sent me an order number everything um not email kept emailing because i had i never did receive a confirmation number they kept saying oh it was a contest uh, if it was a contest i wouldn't have never done it um i don't participate in contests either i'm a paying you're gonna send me a wig or you not um but and I had to call my card company because they didn't want to refund me my money. They didn't want to send me the wig. Even though it was $5, it was $5 that I worked for. Um, so I ended up having to call my card company and getting my card company to refund me. So I'm kind of iffy about ordering from China Lace Wigs. But they are one of the companies that um, does HD Lace um, as well as Wild well, Ebony and RPG Hair, RPG Show something like that um <laughs> i ain't gonna tell you no lie i'm kind of i'm kind of cheap when it comes to buying wigs i mean you get what you pay for um but i don't want to spend two almost three hundred dollars for one week if i'm gonna spend that much then i need to receive two three four weeks which with premium lace wigs um they had a promotion going on they had a wig that was sixty dollars and i think i changed something which made it sixty five dollars and then um this wig was 145 so my total was 210 i had 600 cash points which equals six dollars because i um did a review on the previous two wigs that i ordered from them um earlier this year and then they gave me a they're always doing like the $10 coupon and the $20 coupon I'm trying to figure out why is that doing that I have never seen my camera do that before. That's weird. I just learned something. The FBI is watching me. Well, watch out, honey. I hope you see everything you're trying to see. Anyway. I keep getting off track. Told y'all I got ADD. <laughs> But the lace color is transparent. Um, like I was saying, they do not have, they have not went to the HD lace as of yet. Um, this is my first time taking these. I opened the bag to see what, you know, was both weeks in there because previously when I ordered, um, the weeks came in boxes. So this was new to me to see them come in the bag. Um, fake scalp, no. The hair texture is LW, which looking back in my order it's um brazilian loose wave lace front wig <laughs> it says it says loose wave lace front wig cheap <laughs> pre pre plug 18 inch <laughs> i cannot believe they put that i really hope they were trying to say something else that's kind of weird 
and the length is 18 inches. So, I'm going to try it on. I ain't cut no lace or nothing. Like I said, this is the first time I done took it out. Y'all Y'all see my hair is in this little, I got a little hang time back there though. I hate washing my hair. I'm probably going to spice some water on this stuff tomorrow. Do my little nut set of back there over. And call it a day. I did order the um, easy detangling brush that everybody has been advertising. Like my little ball will not go flat so that's why I think I'm gonna have to wash my hair and I may just have to braid it down let me show y'all this other wig too before I um, try this one on actually so then the second one I ordered which is blonde um, I have not wore a 613 unit um, I have a blonde unit but it's like the um, human hair blend before I got into the uh, Brazilian full lace wigs and all. Um, I kind of picked that up from like my local beauty supply store. Um, but it's a little bit darker than this. It's like a, I don't know, it's, I want to say a 27 and a F427. It's, it was cute but it's some weird colors this one is a 10 inch 100 percent brazil brazilian virgin hair um hair color blonde 16 i mean <laughs> 613 until i told you i'm tired um the hair texture is kinky curly bob the density is 150 i think i changed the density and Yeah, I think I changed the density to change it to $65 because, like I said, it was $60. Um, transparent lace color, and it's a 13 by 4. This one is a 13 by 6, which I normally don't do. I usually just get a glueless full lace wig, which I still have to end up gluing down. I actually need to go to the dollar store tomorrow because i seen somebody do a unit. Um with cream of nature organ oil foaming mousse um because i do have some ghost ghost bun focus baby uh i'm not a real big fan of glue um I done shaved my little edges off because that glue was bothering my edges. And it's like, oh, it's like I had hair here, a bald spot in hair. And I didn't like that. And they're growing back, and it's like they're growing back the same way. So I'm going to have to, that's another reason why I want that oil. Because it's supposed to help your hair grow and all that. So, um, my total was 210 with um with my six hundred cash points six equals six dollars off and my coupon for ten dollars off my total in being 194 um my shipping was free and yeah that's it so let me throw this wig cap on, honey. I think I'm going to go ahead and go wash my hair. So I can braid it down. Because. Made my little, oh, let me my little nut set later. I call it a nut set back there, y'all. Because that's what <laughs> my little ball of hair look like. Somebody text me. I don't know what that is. So, we're going to go with this 
613 first. I, I have a color scheme in mind that I actually want to do with this. I think I want to do the roots um, like a honey, I think it's honey brown. Yeah, I think I want to do the groups honey brown and then dye, dye it um, like a burgundy. I have a three red colors that I want to try. Um, like I said, I don't normally wear a 613 units. So, I did want to try something a little different. Let's see. Uh, me and these adjustable straps don't always get along. They did a horrible job sewing in this band, which means I, who can't sew, gotta go in and fix it. And I told them. Oh, that's pretty snug. And I noticed when I ordered the other two wigs and they came in boxes, I got a pouch in each bag. I mean, in each box, the cones. I got like two cones. When you order two wigs at one time, they only give you one gift bag, as they say. But they did send me extra caps, so this is a little too dark um so i just need to go to the my beauty supply store and pick up some lighter ones so i got two wig caps um which equals four for y'all in the back you can't count i got this little orange it kind of put me in mind of a fanny pack i got um Everything on that thing on lap. Two duck bill clips and elastic band and some body pants. And the kids on. So I ain't even gonna part nothing. Cause this, I'm gonna have to cut those ear tabs. But baby, I am, let me see, because I love me a, I don't know what it is about a deep side part, but I love me a, a it ain't too deep on here, but I love me a deep side part. I'm looking in my mirror that's in front of me. There we go. So you can see the cap. Well, you can see the um, the band of the cap. So I may have to do the um, ball cap method. Can you see it right there? Um, I do want to put some purple shampoo on here kind of take some of that brassiness out that's what I'll do so it don't look like which I don't know how I could see no knots in a 613 unit but um, oh, okay. I see a few, not a lot. And then I see some pieces of black hair in here. I will be emailing them and seeing what's up with that. Like, if it's supposed to be a 613. I need all 
Am I tripping? No, I'm not. Okay. But anyway. falling off. I'm having to find me another wig company because the comb look like it's in here twisted. I find anything wrong with everything. I find everything wrong with anything. <laughs> but that's the inside. So you got about four inches of corner space from here to here um, the hairline does not look um, pre-plucked so I will go in and pre-pluck that just for my liking um, you got Two combs on the side, one comb in the back that is cricket, and then a comb in the dome that I always take out because you just don't need a comb right there in the middle of your head. I'm just, that's just, nah, not in my head. So, what is going on, honey? I'll tell you what your girl about to go take her butt to sleep cause oh that chat and then this is <laughs> the second unit <laughs> Y'all don't judge me. Don't laugh at me. Yeah, that did a horrible job. And that happened on my last two units. I had to go in and sew these straps down. When I specifically said, I can't sew. So make sure y'all sew it in. Damn, I got to go behind y'all. That's the case. I have something on them. Let's it brings in. But I don't want to do that. So, we're going to tighten up this thing, this lacy strap. I hear you creeping somewhere, babe. Okay. I heard her creeping, y'all. I ain't crazy. I'm coming, y'all. <laughs> this damn thing working me. So this hairline does look like it is pre-plucked, but I will, of course, pre-pluck it to my liking. So in here you have, um, it's a 13 by 6. The this 13 one was a 13 by 4. So you got a little extra part of space. Um, two combs on the side. one comb in the back and your um adjustable straps and this one i did notice they did not put a comb in the dome thank you jesus so that's one less comb that i have to remove i mean compared to the lace on my oh look i'll put the thing on crooked y'all 
compared to the lace on my other two units, um, it is. Is it still cricket? Honey, don't be snagging me in the back. Um, I wish I knew she was going to the store. I need to go to the store too. Um, it is a little bit lighter than the lace on my other two units. I think that was a light brown and this is transparent so to speak. Not really matching my skin tone because I am a little bit more on the car car caramel caramel whichever way you choose to say it. Caramel side um this one the knots are not bleached let's see I think it's a track right there so with this one I can do me a, my side part that I love we can even go in a little bit Okay. So then, okay, girl. This kind of it seemed a little short for 18 inches because my last unit from them was 18 inches, and it's a body wave. And oh well, that's about the same. Yeah. Okay, but my other two units, I ordered a Peruvian because everybody's like, oh, Peruvian is better than Brazilian. When I tell you one of them wigs, um, which I think I did a video on where it sheds excessively. So, <laughs> I bleached it, um, and kind of added some highlights and low lights just to try to spice it up a little bit because I always order, you know, natural units. My hair is not a natural color. Um, just by running my fingers through, I am getting a little bit of shedding, but it's like. three four strands so I mean that's that's good um I have not co-washed y'all I swear I keep feeling like something is crawling on me so once I um I ain't tripping that hard now, I know. <laughs> okay. You know what? So, I will, um, gonna go ahead and get these knots bleached, which I will not be filming that. I'm pretty sure everybody has seen a video of somebody bleaching some knots. I know I done seen about 50 million of them. Which I ain't hating. I love to see when um, people do the, the full process. But my videos tend to be a little, little bit long. So I think I'm going to have to learn how to um, do a video and then do a voiceover. So I'm going to bleach the knots. Uh, put hairline. And hopefully, and co wash it. Hopefully, it will be dry tomorrow about this time because usually I try to put my wigs on or you know get them secured um, about seven or eight on Sunday night so that Monday morning I can get up and. Okay, so apparently my video was long. 
and the camera just got tired of me because it cut off. Um, but yeah, so usually what I try to do is I try to get my wigs washed on. Sometimes if we don't have anything to do, I wash them on Friday nights and set them up in here so that they can be dry by Saturday. Wash them on Fridays, dry them on Saturdays. That way um, I can adhere them on Sunday nights around 7 or 8 so that Monday morning when I get up for work the girl can just go, they ain't gonna put the clothes on do what she do and psh, out of the door we go um hopefully I'm hoping that since this is a transparent unit because I'm not sure which unit I will be wearing this week I'm probably gonna wear this one and decide on my coloring scheme on that 613 unit and um what was I saying? Yeah my mind I'm losing my mind like okay so I'm just gonna say this all up okay so hopefully um I'm I'm about to go and watch these now um Hoping that with the lace, that's what I was trying to say, with the lace being transparent, um, that I, I mean, because it, I mean, it's not snug, snug, like I want it to be, um, but I'm hoping that once I cut the lace, that I can put it on without having to add no ghost bond because I really don't like using that glue. I have been using um, the free spray which eh, it does its job for about two days for me um, and I don't even do no hard work. I'm, uh, I'm, I'm in the clerical field. I'm a data entry customer service rep. So I sit at my desk all day and I ain't doing nothing but um, I did use every now and then I'll use the um, got to be in the black tube I'm not a big fan of that um, my favorite I've tried the spritz spritz held about eight hours for me so I mean a typical I could eat them and you know I'm glad to see her back on the tube, but April girl, thank you, cause this stuff, I love it. I mean, it usually lasts. It says 48 hour hold. Um, it usually lasts four to five days for me. So I freaking love that stuff. Um, I got, I think I bought like two or three cans of it. What is this? Okay, let me take this off because y'all, something is on me. And I'm a heebie-jeebie type person. And I really need to decide if I'm going to wash my hair. My hair or not. Oh, it was something that I wanted to show y'all. <laughs> I'm so lazy. So this is the brush. I'm about to lose my mind. Something on me. So this is the um the <laughs> I cannot detangling brush for black dot dot dot. I guess they try to say and fine hair wet and dry pink. But basically it's a easy detangling brush that I see a lot of people using. Um, hopefully this will help me to detangle my hair and stop snatching my hair out. Um, I have a dimming brush around here somewhere. That, that did not work on my hair at all. It slides loose, so it is not the best 
brush for me. No, not. I don't like it. Then I got these. Um, I think I ordered three from Amazon. And I think I picked up two from the Dollar Tree. But it's just a little detangler brush. I used one. I think this is the one I used the other day. Um, I had an old unit that um, I was trying to try out the watercolor. Because I really wanted to know how that watercolor thing works. Um, I think... No, this ain't the one. <laughs> mm, excuse me. I try to keep them separated because I got like so many. I got a black one. I got this blue one. I got a pink one. I think there's a purple one in my purse. I think it's another one somewhere around here. There ain't no telling. But I used that one um, to brush the bleach through that unit that I bleached the other day. Um, my scalp is very itchy. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to try this out and see how it works. I'm about to go take me a shower. Something is on me and it's microscopic or something. Something going on. And I, I'm about to lose my mind. I hate for stuff to be on me and I can't see it. But I can feel it. <sighs> see? I'm tripping. There might be my little edges trying to grow back. <laughs> but the last time I washed my hair, because I usually, I try to keep a bottle of Jamaican black castor oil, um, the wild growth oil. Jojoba oil, jojoba oil, whatever. And um, grapeseed oil and avocado oil. I try to keep them mixed together to put on my um, scalp, especially if I braid my hair down to put my units on. I just kind of put it on my scalp so that my hair can stay moisturized. But um, last week when I washed my hair, I put this coconut oil on there. Butcher boy, really. 100% pure refined coconut oil and I got this from the Dollar Tree um, and it's just that's just where I've been digging into that but I'm not sure if you guys notice but my hair looks I mean I can tell the difference because usually so let me give you a little bit a quick little backstory now I'm, I'm about to go I'm about to lose my mind. So, I had dreads for seven and a half years. They were butt crack length. <laughs> um, and I decided to cut them one year. Cut them shoulder length. Um, and then um, I just got tired of them. Plus, I was looking for a job, and the lady at the temp service was like, Oh, you think maybe no one's giving you a call back about a job because you have dreads? So, cut them off. And I've been natural three years. Uh, but my hair does not hold oil or grease very long. Oh. Flaky scalp. Um, that's the remnants of the coconut oil that I put on my hair last 
Sunday. I think that was last Sunday when I washed my hair. But, um, usually my hair is really, really dry. But I put that coconut oil on it and it, you still got a little moisture, a little shine. My scalp a little dry, but that's neither here nor there. Look at them edges coming in, though. But it still seems like it's, I don't know. Honey, I'm about to shave it all off and just start all the way over. I don't do nothing but wear weeds anyway. But, um, oh yeah, we got some little, got some pinch me here. <laughs> but, um, yeah, so, once I get those wigs cold washed and pumped, not bleached and lace cut I'll come back and with one of them on and y'all will see which one I'm wearing for the week so in the meantime in between time until further notice peace out I'll holler at you